yurt. All right, I heard this shit's insane. If you guys are unfamiliar with the accusations surrounding Colleen Bollinger, a pretty wide array of pedophile and uh, molestation accusations, as well as just general sexual assault accusations surrounding her, and everything I've heard about this apology, it's 10 minutes long, uh, is uh, insane. So I'm very excited to see this. I, I know nothing about it. Uh, it pretty much just came out, but is already very widely disliked. Stop. <laughs> Her face right now. I am so excited to hear this girl sing about how she's not a pedophile. <laughs> you don't break out the uke unless you know it's a real serious apology video. I also think it's worth noting that she put this on what is by far her smallest channel. You should definitely check out uh, Adam McIntyre's content surrounding experiences with Colleen. She didn't use her ginormous main platform, which she posted on three weeks ago with a child. <laughs> so here we go. Hey. It's been Hi. A while since you saw my face. I haven't been doing so great, so I took a little you posted three weeks ago, fam. Saying some things about me that aren't quite true. <laughs> Doesn't matter if it's true, though. Just as long as it's entertaining to you. Doesn't matter as long as there's hours and hours of receipts against you. <laughs> right? You guys having fun? All aboard the toxic gossip train. Chugging down the tracks of misinformation, the toxic gossip train. You got a one way ticket to manipulation station. To How are you gonna write a diss track to respond to your sexual assault allegations with a ukulele? These rumors look like facts if you don't mind the gaps that won't survive in the crash, but hey. What a response. You know, I was expecting a systemic breakdown of everything that was laid up against her as an accusation. Find those gaps that she just referred to. I've been wanting to come online and talk to you about a few things. Like what? Um, even though my team has strongly advised me to not say what I want to say. Your team was correct. I recently realized that they never said that I couldn't sing. Her team is fucking rolling right now. Like, oh fuck, she was right. She, we didn't say she couldn't sing. Why did we say we couldn't? She couldn't sing. Today, I only want to talk about the facts. So, you want to sing about them? I used to message my fans, uh, but not in a creepy way, like a lot of you are trying to suggest. It was more of a loser kind of way. <coughs> Pawn off what she did as a, a loser kind of way of communicating is insane. I was just trying to be besties with everybody. Everybody who was underage. It's kind of like uh, when you go to like a family gathering, you know, and there's a weird aunt there who keeps coming up to you and going like, "Hey, girl, what's the tea?" And you're like, Ugh. Um, "That was me." But with group chat with your fans who were children. Key key fact. I've been sharing my life online for over 15 Not related to you, like an on. I didn't really understand that maybe there should be some boundaries there. There were times in the DMs when I would overshare. I haven't done that for years, you see, because I changed my behavior and I took accountability. These new screenshots show from 2020 and 2021, right after my original video. You're not right now, though. I mean, I'm, I'm, I would hope that you don't do these things anymore. That people are making you take accountability for it now, which you seem to be dodging. <laughs> but that's not very interesting, is it? You're gonna sing for another 10 minutes? Is insane. You've had one good response so far. Sick gossip to like hours and multiple accusations. Locomotives fueled with hateful. Not comparing her to Bill Cosby. But like what if Bill Cosby broke out the uke? You think you think he would have you think he would have spent time? Accusations, the toxic gossip train. And that person you despise maybe didn't deserve to die, but hey. I think I think she took a page out of the Drake playbook where it's like, oh man, I've been chatting with minors, let me just start singing songs. At least you're happy. 
sad and fun. You know, we should hope that everyone can learn from their mistakes and grow and change their behavior and be a better yes. person. And this is something that I've always tried to do when I make mistakes. And it's something that I will continue to try to do. What? Oh, you don't care? Oh. No, I, that, that's exactly what I care about right now. <laughs> But unfortunately, you're not taking accountability. I thought you wanted me to take accountability. I did. But that's not the point of your mob mentality, is it? No. Your goal is to ruin the oh life of the Lord, person you just- Oh my this dumb bitch is going to try to skirt around giving a real response by saying nobody wants a real response. Spies while you dramatize your lies and monetize their demise. She's gaslighting, manipulating. Oh, she's a narcissist. This is such gaslighting to all of her. I could not imagine if for the last couple months as an accuser of Colleen, I've been stewing upon receipts and finding stuff and dealing with their own kind of pushback, right, of being an accuser of someone who's tremendously famous and popular, right? All just to be summed up with an apology video like this is the biggest fucking spit in the face. It's insane. All of you are perfect, so please criticize me. Bring out the daggers made from you. We're not perfect, but we would, I would like to think that people who are criticizing you would take accountability for sexually texting minors. Perfect past and stab me. Who were fans of their content? Like that's like double manipulation layers of like what you're willing to and need the control of. Sure you're disappointed in my shitty little song. Super. I know you wanted me to say that I was 100% in the wrong. Well, you I'm are. Sorry, I'm not gonna take that route. Oh but my god. To lies and rumors that you made up for clout. Hey everybody, I found someone new to harass. She did some things that I do not like in her past. This is so insane. everybody gather around cuz we're about to attack. But not This is like the most unhinged shit. Imagine again for months trudging to just get a response out of Colleen and an apology out of her and her going <laughs> psychopathically with a ukulele. No, I'm not going to respond actually. My reputation's deceased. I hope so. She's PG-13. It says that on my website, and it's always been that way. And that's why you won't find my videos on the YouTube Kids app. Anyway, um... I didn't know people were complaining about that even. It always screamed like children's content to me. PG-13 does tote that line, I guess. But like, oh... I've always relied on parents to decide if they're comfortable with Which their is families fair. watching my YouTube videos or coming to my live shows. That's like the, the easiest thing to respond to that she has to respond to, I guess. I didn't even know that was a talking point, though. Like, I would love some of the other talking points and, like, receipts <laughs> that were brought up to be addressed. Have I made some jokes in poor taste? Yes. Have I made lots of dumb mistakes? Yes. I understand you're trying to rhyme, right? <laughs> That's maybe why this is not the best format for <laughs> an apology video of this magnitude. But to dwindle down what you've done as jokes in poor taste, dumb mistakes. <laughs> Let's see if she does more, but if that's all you're calling them, that's really bad because you've done nothing to address specific victims or specific problems that you were encountering. You've, in fact, belittled them. Was my intention to manipulate? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> nope. <It's, laughs> what, is, what is this, a fucking E40? Yup. <laughs> it doesn't really matter what my intention was because it seems as though everyone's already decided on that. Yup. <laughs> Five minutes into your apology videos, six minutes? Yes, I have. Disgusting, life ruining words. Matter that these things are she true. really thought she was cooking, yo. Uh, That's the problem. Everyone just believes <laughs> that you are the type of person who manipulates and abuses children. So I just wanted to say that um, the only thing. You don't let the uke go after you say that. Maybe you stop the uke and then make a four minute real apology, please. I'm not a groomer. I'm not a groomer, I'm just a loser is bar of the century. Who didn't understand I shouldn't respond to fans, and I'm not a predator, even though a lot of you think so. Not even following general song structure anymore. You shouldn't just not respond to fans, which is a problem. You should not respond to fans that are underage in an intimate manner. <laughs> because five years ago, I made a fart joke. Again, all the belittling is insane. I... Mm. Even though 
I know this video won't change anyone's mind about me. I never had any bad intentions. <laughs> that's that's the start of an apology. You're gonna do something real? For, um, I can't believe there's another three minutes of this almost. But I do feel like shit. You should. Rumors look like facts when you don't mind the gaps. To explain them. Stop. She's gonna give herself an encore. Maybe you're confused about something. I don't know. Let me try to help. Can, um, you, can you start explaining maybe the timeline of how things happen and <laughs> where, we're, where we're going wrong, please? Now, eight minutes into this apology, nine. Sometimes people make a mistake and it doesn't make them a horrible person. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Uh, but it does when you dodge all responsibility and Some break out a musical instrument to apologize without really even apologizing. It's not like I feel like this is this is dodging all accountability while simultaneously not apologizing. <laughs> oh no. Sometimes people can make a mistake. It doesn't mean you gotta send them hate. Oh no. Sometimes You're right, but if you're not addressing a problem of this magnitude, and I think you're about to get even more shit, I'm not gonna lie to you. <laughs> you, you don't break out a ukulele for an apology video that you don't apologize in without getting shit. People can grow, but that generally takes time. Not to say that it hasn't been time since these actions, but you seem to be dodging all accountability now. It doesn't seem like it's something you've ever addressed. It just makes them... You're right, but again, of this magnitude, if you, you've basically kind of confirmed everything that Adam and everybody else has said. <laughs> so, like, I think that does kind of make you a terrible human in some ways. What do I know? Fuck me, right? 